Okay. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I'm streaming through Twitch. I think I am, but it looks it looks okay. But I'm not sure. <clears throat> oh boy. Okay. Anyways, hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Zero J Ranagod, and today on the stream, we're going to be making chocolate milk in blender. <clears throat> feeling, hope I'm feeling okay. But before we get to that, I want to go ahead and make a quick shout out to a new follower here. Two days ago, let me see, Miss Lessian gave us a nice follow today, or two days ago, or, oh man, it's been a busy day, guys. Been a very busy day, but to Miss Lessian, thank you, welcome to the family, and I hope to, I hope that, um, these streams are are entertaining to you and to all of you. And you, um, hi. Uh, anyways, <sighs> great. Yeah, it's it's been a busy day, guys. I'm sort of. I was intended to do this earlier this morning, but I had to be in several places. But anyway, let's go ahead and get to the chocolate milk then. So, I've been playing around with Blender quite a bit. Trying to get good at it. Oh dear. Because I have big plans for it. Yep, yep, yep. So, first and foremost, let's go ahead and start off by getting rid of all this. Goodbye. And here's what we're going to... Here's what I want to do. I want to have chocolate milk pour from, a, from one cup to another cup. So let me go ahead and add a collection, a new collection here. And collection one will be called cup one. And collection two, I'm going to name it cup two. Okay, cup one will be very, very normal. It's Let's go ahead and grab ourselves a cylinder. Raise that up a bit. Up on the Z axis. Thank you. And we're going to have you. Let's go fix a few things. One, I want. Let's go into the edit mode. Grab ourselves the face here. And then. Let's do a quick extrusion. Extrude through the Z axis. Go up. Thank you. Scale that down just a wee bit. Good. Move it down again. No, wait, not there. What the heck? Oops, I did a bad. Grab you. Move you back into the center area. Uh, and move you again back up. That does not seem even. Oops. Kind of center that sucker again, best I can. Okay, cup one will be idle and will not be moving. And we're going to go from here and extrude, but it'll let down the z-axis. Z z-axis. Good, good, good. Okay, maybe a little more downwards. Okay, I think this is our first cup, but I do want to make it a little better. I should have done a thing. It doesn't look like a sexy cup. Let's go fix that. Can you scale this down? Okay. Uh, and you? Can you also be scaled it down? That's a sexier cup. A little bit more. There we go. Hey, nice. Uh, let's go ahead and take a modifier. Add a bit of... We're gonna add... Hey, Goofy King. Hey, how you doing? Hope you've been having a good day. It's nice to see you. Uh, let me see. Go ahead and do a quick subdivision. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, you look ugly. You know what? No, no, we don't need a subdivision. You're fine. You're fine. 
Let's not uh, let's, let's not get too far. Okay, we got our standard cup. It's going to be here. It's here to just be there. This is the one that's going to be idle. And since it's going to be working with fluids, let's go ahead and add a little physics. Fluid. What type? Domain, which means this is the one that's going to be capturing the fluid. The type of fluid, or type that's going to be capturing the liquid, and we're going to leave everything else here. So... I've been watching quite a few tutorials about how to do liquids and fluids because I wanted to do an ocean scene. And I keep having technical issues when doing this fluid. Sometimes it works where I get to see particles that will show that are, will tell me where the um, where the where the fluids are going to be interacting and how it's all going to splash around. But then other times I absolutely don't see anything. And I heard that's because you have to change where this buffered stuff or where, where these little fluid simulations will be saved in. I tried that, and I still run into problems. So I still got to take a further look. Hopefully, this all works good because this is not saved anywhere else. This is just a blank, fresh new document, not document, project. So hopefully, it everything runs as smooth as butter. Now... So we got ourselves our good standard cup. I'm going to go ahead and take the cylinder because I like how I did this cup and I'm going to duplicate it. Ooh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? My duplication. Oh, wait, I'm in edited mode. Get out of editing mode. There you go. Uh, oh, can I smooth shade? Hey, 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 now you're even sexier. Oh, nice. Okay, let's go ahead and duplicate object. There you go. I'm going to stick it off to the side. Cylinder cup two will be over here. And I'm going to call this Chalky Cup. Chalky Cup. There you go. Now, in this cup... It, it, what, come on. Wait, wait. What is that? Oh, yes. It also carried over the um, modifiers. How nifty. Okay, that's good. Because in this same modifier... Where is the liquid? Liquid. Physics. You are a effector. Whoop, not flow. Effector. Because I'm going to do something a little different here. Because I'm going to add. It's not going to be just chocolate milk. It's going to be choking milk on the rocks. So let's get this guy travel through the y-axis real quickly. Scale you town, and I'm gonna call you. Get over here, the rocks. There you go, the rocks. Um, I will rough you up in a moment, but first, I would like to move you to whoop, not this, <laughs> not the z-axis. No, no, no. We're gonna get uh, y-axis. Then I'm gonna move you up the z-axis. A. Here we go. And um, let's slide you a little bit to the to the side. Okay. This is oops. No, look up for a moment. Grab center. Yeah. Good. 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 Whoa. So I'm gonna have this in here. It's golf ball, and it's gonna be the emitter. You're going to emit the fluid that I want. Oh, man. I just had myself pizza and wings, and I really hope the acid doesn't come to kill me. Which probably will. You're going to be the flow. What kind of flow? The one for liquid. Geometry. Outflow. No, inflow. Yes. So you're going to be pouring in of the fluids now so we got that there we got this cup here and here's what i want uh, unless who thoughts but i'll try to keep it as simple as possible okay i'm gonna get do a slight bit of animation here um take these two sets here let's insert a keyframe is that did i do a thing 
No. Gosh damn it. Is there a keyframe? No. Um, that, no. Gosh. Bloody hell, man. Okay. Can I insert a keyframe here? No. Why? Why you no do keyframe? Ah, oh, come on. Okay, so here's here's my plan. To have, let's grab this thing, to have this cup start to get filled with the chocolate milk. And then it'll rotate and pour it out. That's the that's the plan. But I can't seem to be any I'm not inserting a keyframe. Why is no keyframe going in? Keyframe type, just keyframe. And you no know work. Bless damn you. Well, this will be an easy part, but the crush the, the, the questionable thing is whether or not I can get this thing to emit fluids. Unless I make this also an effector. I mean, domain. Should I make it into a domain? I'll play with effector just in case. But we should go for domain. Okay, so I'm going to do a quick check and have this um, rotate along the y-axis. Whoops, no, wrong area. Along the x-axis. There we go. I'll have it angled like this. Go. Slide you over here. Oops, the ball. Did not grab the ball there. Whoop, whoop. There you go. Everything's good. Everything is awesome. <laughs> I'm a spill. Move along the x-axis. There we go. Okay, everything's aligned. Everyone's good? Good. Good. Now, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the rocks. And I think... Everything is okay. So the rocks, the flow, liquid, inflow, initial velocity. Uh, which direction? We want to go a little bit towards the uh, y-axis. So give me a negative. What would it be positive? I don't know which one's positive direction, negative direction. So I'll do a negative so-and-so meters per second. And chalky cup. You are a effector collision that is good. Subsampling will leave you the way it is. And the other cylinder. You are a domain. You're a liquid resolution. That's a good one. Border collisions. That's a good one. Flip, flip, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to change this because replay doesn't seem to work for me. I'm not sure why. Modular works where I get to see particles but for some reason I can't get the materials to work but uh, go ahead and bake and show me what you got if it doesn't work I'm gonna scream internally screaming internally and this this is what I'm talking about this is Mm. Free the data. See, that makes no sense, yo. Like, why? Why isn't this doing the thing? Bruh. Okay, here we go. Um, you are an inflow. Do we do a subsampling bit? Flow source. The mesh, let's try making it planar. I don't know what this is going to do. Surface emission, just add that on there. Let's make it into a positive direction. Source. Can I, can I insert a keyframe? <sighs> you guys suck, man. Okay, chalky cup. You're fine. Subsampling. I'll add three just in case. Cylinder domain liquid adaptive. So and so such and such is. Ah la da 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 da. Viscosity. I'll leave it there. Diffusion. 
Might as well add that there. Mesh. For some reason, I can't use mesh. Yeah, I can't make any mesh data. What a pity. Don't use the mesh. Guides. Sure. Add the guide. Velocity source. Guide parent. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Okay, turn off the guide then. There will be no guide. Resumable? I guess so. Ah, uh, and let's try it again. Bake it. Shake and bake, bruh. I'm not saying anything. Yeah, I'm not saying anything. I'm, I'm not saying any. Oh, come on. Why? Why? Ah, uh, okay. Um, free the data. What if if it's that there, the rocks. Flow, liquid. Let's change it from inflow to just geometry. Does that make the difference? I don't think so, but... And it doesn't! Bam! Lalas. Okay, let's go back to uh, outflow. Inflow, there you go, inflow. Or is it outflow? No, I think it's inflow. Subsampling source. Okay, fine. I have to go to the YouTubes. <sighs> Dang it, I was hoping to not do this. Okay, fine. Blender. Blender Water Simulation. Ah, da 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 See, this makes no sense. Okay, let me see. Okay, now let's net. Oh, do we have to save it? Oh, okay, so we add the UV sphere, increase the size. Okay. So they smoothed out the, uh, they smoothed out the sphere here and added some additional subsurfaces some sub subdivision which I think eh, God will be fine and then they smoothed it out she smooth which honestly it's potato we smooth <laughs> right now okay so what next tutorial what next you want to go to physics settings you turn on the fluid it is it's a flow. Okay, liquid inflow supple sampling. Okay, got that. Oh, maybe that's why it's not working. I'll take a double check. Okay, the rocks. We go to check the fluids. Inflow, I already have it at four, which I guess it's fine. Surface emission. Initial velocity. Well, actually, yeah, it's that's pretty good. Okay, then what is happening? Oh, 
What about here? It said the end frame 43. Well, let me just do 250. Oh, wait, no, that's where you want it placed. Okay. Okay, flow behavior is an inflow. Oh. Uh, oh, okay, so they added some. Wait, wait, wait. So he added keyframes. And then. Okay, so you added. So let me go over here to frame one. And. What did you do? Behavior inflow, and then you adjusted it to geometry. So let's say it's inflow, put a marker. Okay, and then right here it turns into geometry marker. Planar, initial velocity, so and so. Cylinder, liquid, bake it. I like how janky it looks. Did we get somewhere? Is this all I needed to do? Just a few clicks? What do you got for me? Oh, oh, it's beautiful. Oh, the splashing effects. Oh my gosh, it's so real. What the hell, man? Well, the other thing I didn't do was also save, but I'm not sure if saving does anything. Okay, select the domain, and then they baked it. Mm hmm. Damn it! Like, why? Oh, why does this stupid thing work? Why? You know, it like seems easy to do, but then like for some reason, it's not. Mmm, that's a pain, yo, that's a pain. Okay. Okay, the rocks. Let's see. Uh, go to the cylinder again. Okay, the big data thing is not there. Modular, I don't think it really matters. Fluid, where are you? Fluid cache, so and so. Whoa. Mmm. <sighs> Freaking hey, man. Freaking hey. Do we have to add cash fluid? Why? I'm not seeing anything being placed in there. Like, I should see a huge list of things. But no, I don't. Okay, here's an idea. Let me go pop this in the desktop and create a new folder. Call it Kish. We'll put it in Kish. Let's see if that works. Here we go. Modular. Go bake. Come on, you gotta work for me. Both teams got on you. Don't let the family down. Ah, fuck it. Ah, all right, all right, all right. 
experimenting. Where's the uh, kishk? Kishk config. You got a whole bunch of data. Data. You got fluid stuff. Why aren't we getting anything? This is an absolute nonsense. Damn it. All I ask is that you work right. Why you don't work right? You have one job. Why do you fail us? Why do you fail us? Oh, LMMS. Ah, uh, where was the thing? I forgot. Fine, you keep the cash thing over here if you want. Why do you fail us? Huh. Well, let's see what else this tutorial has to offer. Well, that big section was kind of important. Okay, well, um, here's, here's, a, here's what I wonder. Okay, okay, okay. We're, if I gotta save this, sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and try to save this. We're going to call it Chocolates Chocolates and um, let's uh, go, go up, a, up a thing. Here we go. And let's do a folder. And we're going to call it Chokey. There we go. And a new one we're gonna call it Cash Catches. There you go, catches. Okay, just save it here. Good. You will be da -da 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 -da. on the desktop, then we go to production, and then we go to fit 3D studio, and then we go to Chokey, and then we go to caches. Here we go, accept that. That's where you're gonna put your thing. Good. Let me go ahead and do the th get this and get rid of it. Nice. Alright, back end. Three, two, one, bake. Oh, free data. Okay. Bake. Do I even see particles? Is there even particles in there? A ball. Ooh, it's so... They look like pudding. Like a big old round yogurt dipped kind of joy here. Anything emitted? Are you are you too close? Are you too? Then you got space in there, right? Yeah, you got space. It's still a nice cup. I like that cup. Okay. Hmm. Well, I'll be damned. Um. Do I have to? Well, sub sampler is already at a four. I gotta like. Slam it up high. Don't kill my computer, please. Please don't. Free. Big. This poor bastard. It's gonna hate me. Gonna hate me till the end of its days. Yeah, so lately this has been happening, where I'm trying to do some fluid simulations, but it doesn't want to work. Uh, uh, such a disappointment. So much potential. So much 
추억이 막 그쵸죠 Hmm. Why? Why doesn't it work? That's the question. Okay, going from source to mesh. Okay, let's say it's not planar. Initial velocity, just none. It's not creating stuff. Chalky cup, you're just collision. Guess it's planar. Cylinder, you're just here to pick it up. Oh wait, what if? What if because it's considered a domain? Hmm. You know what? Yes. What if that's the issue? Okay, okay, okay. You're not a domain. You're an effector. And we're going to create a new mesh, make it a uh, cube. Okay, scale it up a bit. Grab that face. Make it extend through the stars. Whoops, nope. <gasps> Ooh, okay, so we have that. Good. Um, okay. Now, can I? What was it here? No, I think it was here. No, here, nope, here, nope, here. Shoot, just wireframe it. Righteous. Okay. Now, this, this cube right here, I'll stick it outside because it's not a cup. Oh, wait, all these are supposed to be a cup, too. Get, get in your, get in the cup, too, chalky cup in the rocks. Get in there. Cube, you will be our designated domain guy. The liquid. Good. Good. So we'll talk about time stamps, steps to perform for one frame rate. Uh, I don't know. Raise that a few times. Just a few. Okay, you know what? Just, I'll leave it there. Everything's good. Normal. Okay, I'll try this. Actually, go to the folder that I need you to be in. Right here. Go. Use that one. Okay, not replay modular because replay doesn't work do it do the bake does it work does it not work it doesn't work Ugh. Well, does this have to happen this not make sense viscosity does the viscosity have an effect you know no, this diffusion. Great. Try it again. Time to put it in the baking oven. Bake. Yo, if this doesn't work, I'm gonna make jello instead. And okay. So, guess what? We're making jello. Or some sort of gelatin flopper. Cup one, cup two. Let me just get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. Okay, fine. Go ahead and add a, a mesh. You know what? A toros. We're going to add a toros. We're also going to add a plane. This plane is going to be scaled up and get out of wireframe. Get onto solid. And we're going to move it down just a wee tad. There we go. Here's what we're going to do. This thing, all right, this thing, this thing you see here, is going to behave like uh, we're going to add a modifier here. Ocean. But we're going to have it displace. Reason being, watch this. So I'm going to put a timestamp here. I'm going to go over here. Set this to 25 for me. 
you go 25 set a timestamp there how do you move good this is what i want i want this i want this jiggly bit good good after that i'm gonna go ahead and uh, add a collider so give me some collision good geometry no, over here i gotta go to physics collision we go soft body dampening and friction thickness yes also a rigid body you're not going to be active you're passive you're going to stay no no you're active what am i doing stupid don't get rid of the rigid body get rid of it we don't need it there you go you're moving how's this look good torus torus i want you my good dear friend to subdivide unreasonably as one does um that's not it that's solidify keep doing that subdivide now we're gonna do it by three. Oh, what a jiggly donut good and go ahead and apply that just apply that you will also have a soft body physics you will collide with all of it. Go edge of self collision. No. Okay. Now. Go. Uh oh. You okay? You okay, computer? Oh, shoot. We got frame rate issues. Ooh, 6 FPS. Ooh. All right, calm down. We'll fix this. Object, mass. We gotta be way heavier. Oh shit, Suze. She's not doing well. Okay, get rid of the soft body thing. Maybe we went too far. Hmm. Okay, what if we have collision? Go. Okay, you didn't do anything. Okay, let's add the rigid body. But it is active. Go. You're supposed to hit that, you twat. All right, get back up. Hmm. Uh, scene collection. Let's go ahead and add the floor. Spelled incorrectly. Plane. Get over there. Good. Also, extend your size because for fun. And rigid. No, no. Go to Torus. 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 You didn't, you, uh, bastard. Oh, wait a minute. The plane. Do you have collisions? You do have collisions. You do have collisions. Kill particles. Whoa. Brutal, man. Gosh. Um. Hmm. Well. Rigid body constraint. Uh, new rigid body active to form surface. No, dude, how did I do it before? Okay, Taurus. If we add, you have collisions, soft body. Collision data, the floor, go. It fell. 
blowing it, man. I'm blowing it. Okay. This is just... Okay. But twice is not doing. Damn it. Ah. I feel like such a such a noob with this program. Like it's it's kind of annoying when you see a tutorial, you follow the tutorial, but then nothing happens still. That kind of gets me. Kind of gets me, man. Okay, why why you no work? <sighs> Just, I just need you to interact with this guy down here. All right, all right, all right, fine, fine. Let's say, okay, let's say we go to the plate, right? And we get rid of that ocean. I wanted it to move around, but... All right, let's get rid of the ocean. Wait, the plane is a soft body thing? Mm hmm. Oh, it does. Oh, that's weird. Collision. Let's make it rigid then. And your rigidness, it will be passive. Go. Hey, it made contact. First contact has been made. Good. Now, the Taurus will have soft body. Give me some squishies. You will collide with the floor. Floor. Go. Oh gosh. This is not good. It's going slow. It's going slow. You okay, mate? Here's an idea. Perhaps this Taurus is too much faces. Add another. We're gonna just add the soft body glide with the floor. Add a little extra weight in there. There you go, simulation and go. Okay. You kind of bounce. Which is a little weird for me. Boing. Increase the mass. There we go. Plurable, 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 plurable. Nice. I should make you look pretty. Hmm. I got an idea. I got an idea. Get rid of you. Stop the stop the player. Okay. Yeah, I got an idea. So if we grab, okay, a uh, get rid of the plane for a moment. Oh no, I'm feeling exhaustion already, guys. Can you believe that? Absolute nonsense. Add collection, and we're gonna add no. Add a cylinder. Let's go here and grab this face, please. Can you grab that face? There you go. Scale it up. Good. Yes. That's what I like. Yes, 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 yes. And should you be moved downward? Nope. A little more, a little more up. Got it. Got it. And let's do a quick modification, add some subdivision up to six. Whoop. Oh, hey, look at that. It looks delicious, actually. Uh, let's look at a simple subdivision, if you don't mind. Yeah. Mm, maybe not six. Do three. We'll do three at least. Oh, I can't apply it here. I have to go over here. There we go. Go ahead and apply. Nice shade, smooth. I regret it. Blip. All right, 
Okay, no. How about no? How about no? What in the hell did you do? <clears throat> okay, it's kind of interesting. Okay, um, I'm gonna work with it though. All right, shading. Okay, let's make it delicious looking. I'm thinking about a good fruit juice, fruit punch kind of color with a little gloss. Yeah, give me the sweet gloss, yo. All right, so we're gonna need a shader, mix shader. Add another shader. This one is a gloss. Yes, my gloss. Move you here. Don't do that to me. Go over here. Yep. Okay. You. Base color. Can we get a nice rubyish red? This one. I'm just going to go red, red. Whoa! <laughs> oh, you kind of look cool. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of cool looking. Don't like how glassy it looks. Well, not glassy. Sorry. Um, how polygonal? Polygonal color. Okay. We also might want to add another. Okay, another mix shader, put it here. And we're going to add No, nah, that's transparency. Translucent. Do this. Shoot. Okay, fine. Yeah, get it out. Get it out. Yeah, there, there we go. Um Alpha. That's right. There we go. And isn't it upon here that we can change the blend mode to alpha blend? Oh my gosh, what the hell happened to you? Oh, okay. Ooh, well, look at you, pretty sucker. Okay, well, is he not, not exactly all the way here? Hold on, hold on. If I get rid of you... Yeah, that actually works. Get rid of you. Put it you back over there. Uh, get them more rough. Oh, because the alpha blend. Give us opaque. Hmm. Hashed. Oh, kind of looks gumdroppy. Whoa, dude. That's weird. Alpha clip. Okay. That doesn't seem to do as much as I thought it would. Okay, and let's go add our soft body to you. Doopy doopy doo, soft body. Where am I going? It's over here. 
Soft body, soft body. Good. Collision set. Um, if you do or Mass will make a collapse. Show me the plane and go. Don't crash, please. Um. Okay. Maybe a little more mass. <laughs> Jiggles. It still feels like it's kind of hanging from something. I don't know why I kind of love it tastes like that. I had self collision. Oh, I had regrets. Whoa. Okay, get rid of that. Edges. Ah, oh, well, they're just bloop, bloop, bloop. I made a slime. How cute. I should probably. That's what gold does. Oh. Okay, so it sets a. Uh, Stiffness. Oh, look at that. Magical. Dampening. Raise this up a little. There we go, it's a goopy. Who's a goopy? Whoa. It sort of just like doesn't want to move though. Whoa. That is wicked. It's fun to just play with this sometimes. Oh, yes. Why did I shade it if I didn't need to do the thing? Huh. So I can get this to work. Uh, if I grab this plane right, move it this way, rotate it this way, kind of move it this way again. There you go. Go back and do it. Okay, what if I added, go to the cylinder, like a rigid body. There you go. <laughs> That's what I wanted to see. I wanted to see some physics action, yo. Yeah. Floop. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, damn. Hold on, I got this big old knot here. Let me fix Okay, let me do a quick audio check. Is it working? Yeah! All right, that's good. Yeah, that is huge knot. I had to finish to clean it out. Okay, here we go. Oh, it kind of slides. It kind of slides, and I don't like that that much. What if we increase the mass? No, don't increase the mass. You stinker. What you do... Let's reduce the stiffness, not to flat. Okay, put it over around here. Forget the dampening. Go. Oh. <laughs> it fell right through. Holy jeez, dude. <laughs> it was kind of gross. That was honestly kind of gross looking. If I'm honest. Give me a solid view, just in case. <laughs> Wait. That sucker went right through it. Okay, it interacted with the object, but then it just... <laughs> I expected a... a little 
add edges in there. Oh, oh my frame rate is dying. I was kind of hoping it would slide down it. It's following the general direction, but it's as if the uh, object doesn't... See, you behave, but I can't get the liquid to work. Absolutely silly. Why is this a thing? Oh, okay. Well, I think I've been dicking around with this thing for long enough. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's obvious that I have a lot of work ahead of me when it comes to getting good with this program. That is for sure. And I have a lot of work ahead of me for some plans. I got plans. I got big plans. And I'm going to finally take them on. So I'm going to be making videos that are of gameplay. Are gameplays with a cinematic twist in there. I'm going to be creating dramatic openings. And um, if possible, I'll also be making some 2D animations along with them. It all depends on the game. And this is going to be the first time that I'm going to be doing something like this. It's going to be pretty big. I feel like it's going to take some time, that's for sure. Definitely going to take some time. So when it is near completion and ready to be released, there will be a small trailer or a little, little loop that will post on Twitter. For now, it's time to say goodbye. So if you guys like this video, or, and uh, <clears throat> ooh, and uh, want to be notified of any more of these streams or the possible series that I'm going to be putting up, then go ahead and click the... Okay. Um, if you're watching this on, on Twitch, go ahead and click the follow button and the notification bell to be notified. If you're watching this through YouTube, go ahead and push uh, the subscribe button and the notification and the bell to be notified. This series, um, I suppose I can be, I'll post the first, I'll stream the first episode of it through Twitch and through YouTube. But the remainder of the episodes will be posted on YouTube. I do have a scheduling plan, which is funny because I don't even, I still have a lot to do. Anyways, yeah, big, big productions. And I have to make sure to be careful about it. Things can go right. But anyways, thank you guys for um, joining me. And uh, I'll see you all next Monday. And for, for you guys who don't know, I have, I have altered my streaming schedule to do it Mondays. I was going to go for Monday mornings, but today was a little busy, so I had to do it this evening. But once a week on Mondays, I'll see you guys next Monday. And on that stream, I guess I'll do 2D animation. That one's a lot more easier for me, oddly enough. Anyways, next week, next Monday, 2D animations. I'll see you guys then, but until then, remember, be bold, be creative, be you.